Hi, today I'm gonna teach you how to analyze a split plot in CRD and RCBD using STAR software. On my previous video, I already taught you how to input data on split plot design in Excel and also how to import data file in STAR software. The data file that we previously made is we're gonna use it for this video. Now, let's start. First is, you're gonna open the STAR program. Okay, now we already open our, our STAR program. Now let's go to sample data or on the data file. Now, on the previous video I made is, the file name of my data file is the number of leaves. Leaves. Just click it, and this is the file we made last on my last video on my previous video. Take note that in doing uh, in doing this type of analysis, you should know or uh, you should know what is your main plot and subplot. Okay because there is a difference between using factorial split plot okay make it sure also that the number of leaves uh the, the data on the number of leaves the number uh it should be correct according to the treatment combination if there is something missing or what i say is uh wrong input of data it may cause also wrong Mm, result of an, an of analysis or it could be or could result also to wrong conclusion or interpretation of the of the result now we're gonna do is let's go to the analyze here in the top portion of the top uh, left portion of your computer just go to analyze click the analyze then there is a lot of choices here. There is a descriptive statistics, t-test, test of proportion, chi-square test, and analysis of variance. Uh, and we're gonna choose is the analysis of variance or ANOVA. First, this time we're gonna do is the split plot in CRD. Split plot in CRD and to be followed by split plot in RCBD, okay? Let's go to split plot in CRD. Just click the analysis of variance, then click the split, uh, click the split plot, and just choose split uh, completely randomized design. Okay, got it? Then click it. Okay, now we have numeric variables and factors the numeric vari uh, the numeric variables or the number of the number of leaves should be inside the response variable all your parameters must be the response variable okay just click it here add here okay the main plot or it should be inside in the mean plot factor also the subplot it should be in the subplot factor also and the replication should be in the replication okay that's it okay just click okay and there you have it you have the result of uh anova for number of leaves in split plot CRD design. Look, this is the summary information and this is the ANOVA. Okay, this is the CV below and the table of means uh, below the summary of statistics below of the below is the table of means. Okay, Look at this ANOVA table of number of leaves 
in the uh, what is this in CRD in split plot CRD design you can see I what I said is CRD don't have a replication or block based on the on the ANOVA table you cannot see the what is this the replication you can see is the main plot the error of the main plot the subplot the interaction of the main plot and the variety and the error of the subplot and the interaction and the total that is ito yung this ANOVA table you will just copy it copy it with the summary of statistic and CB copy and just paste it on the word okay got it now let's proceed on how to analyze on how to analyze a uh, split plot in CR RCBD design okay first is let's gonna use all same data okay first is go to analyze click the analysis of variance and proceed to split plot design now we're gonna use the randomized complete block design just click the randomized complete block design okay response variable is the number of leaves the main plot is your fertilizer rate just add here the subplot is on the, the variety is add here the replication is add on the block okay just click OK just wait okay this is we have already the result for analysis of variance uh, for in a split plot in split plot randomized complete block design for number of leaves okay you're gonna see this is the ANOVA table this is the ANOVA table and this is the summary of statistic where the CV and the CB for factor A, uh, main plot A, and CB for uh, subplot. I gonna see you gonna see in this section when you look at the ANOVA table of the number of leaves in a split plot in RCBD. The difference you one of the first you're gonna see the difference is the presence of replication. This replication is on CRD don't have but on the RCBD the presence of replication is present because it uh, uh, it is also a requirement in the RCBD design replication or blocking on the ANOVA table you can see the replication the sources of variation the replication the main plot the error of the main plot this is the subplot and the interaction of the main plot and subplot and the error of subplot and the interaction and also the total okay I'm gonna do also it's just the same on the CRD just copy the ANOVA table anti to summary of statistics and just paste it on on the microsoft word office okay i think that's end my i think that's end my presentation and that's end my presentation and i hope you learned something on my on my simple vi uh, simple video on how to analyze a split plot in CRD and RCBD using star software i hope so that this will help you a lot thank you and don't forget to subscribe on my channel okay thank you